part two of doing your own DIY bag backdrop. Um, in today's video, I'll be making a more flowery theme uh, backdrop. So I'm just gonna go right ahead and show you guys what I'll be using. All right, guys. So for this tutorial, you'll need crepe paper. So I have these. You'll need something to tie it. So I have floss. Now I forgot to buy thread and um, I have a ton of floss. Floss is very strong. It doesn't actually rip when you pull it. So I'm going to use that instead. You'll need some sort of glue or depends on the decoration that you decide to put. You'll go accordingly. But I'm going to put glitter. So, so I'll be using my tacky spray and my glitter for my last video. You'll also need something to stick it or glue it to the cardboard. So I'll be using a cardboard just like the one that I use for this wall. Oh, by the way, I did not get a chance to add another piece to it, but I will afterwards. Um, yeah, so I'll be using that cardboard and you'll need something to glue whatever I'll be making to it. So I, I've actually pre-made a bunch of what I need. So let me, I'll just work. So these are what we're going to be making. So this, this is what my wall is going to be made up of. So it's just a crepe paper with um, crystals as my decoration, the tacky spray with the glitters. So we're gonna be making a bunch of these. One half to so take these two, these two, and fold them like this. So you can fold these equally or you can fold it however you want to. It does not matter. To me it doesn't matter. Then you cut your floss or your thread I should say and you tie this in the middle. So tie it in the middle. shape you cut it into that's how your flower is going to look so I'm gonna cut it like a little oval like in an oval shape like this
And this, ladies and gentlemen, is what the final product looks like. Um, later on, I will be adding crystals to all of them, just like this. But for now, I'm just gonna leave it like the way it is. I'm just gonna add a little, one more flower over there, and uh, yeah. Hope you guys like, share, comment, and subscribe. Don't forget to hit the notification bell as well, so you can be the first one to notify every time I upload a new video. Yeah.